What's up, Jones Balls? It is your girl, United Lee Random. And today, I do not have a TikTok of the day, but I just wanted to sit in front of y'all and talk to you, okay? It's been a lot. A lot has been going on, even though it sometimes doesn't feel like a lot. I go through periods, so I feel like a lot is happening, and then I get overwhelmed. And then I go through periods where I'm just like, I'm just so old, underwhelmed. I want something to happen. Things aren't happening. And when I say I want things to happen, I'm not talking about, like, drama or stressors or anything. Uh, I get enough of that on my day-to-day -day life. Like, I can stress myself out, like, boom. I can think about, like, the future and, and how I went to college for, like, six years and, like, what am I doing with my career and like what like how am I gonna make money and like society is hard and oh my gosh it's starting to happen you know I'm stressing myself out so anyway let's go ahead and talk more about that while I'm washing my face I'm still washing my face with the Paytas Miracle Elixir I know I made the video a couple days ago talking about how I was gonna stop for a little while but like it doesn't seem like that product is coming anytime soon like I sent away for it for a week ago and maybe because of like Christmas and how things are crazy for the holidays maybe they're just taking a little bit of their time and it's like okay cool I understand but like you could hurry up though um so at this point y'all gonna go ahead and watch the intro and I'm gonna go ahead and get this started it was at this moment that he knew he fucked up And we are back. Now, I just want to go ahead and point out that Trisha Paytas got married and I somewhat called it. Okay, I didn't call it before it happened, but I called it the day of um, the time really dawned on me. Okay, because one of the things is Trisha Paytas was making hints that her marriage was going to be a little bit later in the month. And because of that, I was like, okay, it's going to be later in the month. So I was thinking like the 20th or something. But then it dawned on me. I was like, no, she said something in a video talking about next week. We're going to be like married next week. And she didn't mean to say it. As soon as she said it, she was like, oh. And I was like, mm, next week, you say. And so I just kind of put it down to she was getting married on like the 12th because, you know, 12, 12, 21, a lot of twos and a lot of ones. It didn't dawn on me that she would be getting married on the 11th until the 11th. I looked at the time and I was like, 12, 11, 21. You split that down. That's 121. That's 121. So, yes, I called it a little bit late, but I called it on my TikTok page. So, you know, I, I, I might be cut out for this drama life, you know, drama channel. I don't think I'd ever want to be a drama channel if we're going to be real. Um, but I would like to talk about mental health and things that I'm doing in my life and all that. So, um, I don't know where this channel is really going to be going. Like, I should be posting pick a card readings every other day. I should be doing certain things. And I just kind of like... I've fallen off a little bit. I'm not posting two videos a day, but come on, you guys. Y'all weren't going to watch two videos a day, you know? Y'all are getting y'all are getting bombarded with a lot of videos of me. And, like, I figure that if I, like, stagger them out a little bit, you know, we'll be good. As long as I'm putting out a video every day, I feel like I'm doing something. So I continue to put out a video every day. I need to actually edit a video so that I can post it so that it can come out pretty soon so like i've been all over the place oh no i got soap on my face well it's on my face but like on my like eyeball a little bit but anyway i washed my face i took a bath like i took like a three hour bath like that water was looking that water was looking kind of bad when i got out of the bathtub i'm not gonna lie uh, i soaked i did body scrubs i didn't lotion my body after i got out of the bath i was like three hour bath oh, gotcha, gotcha. All right. have a good night Que pasa? Que pasa? Give me a second. I'm going to go ahead and rinse off my face and Stu will let me know what happened out there. <laughs> que pasa? Uh, I just uh, was talking to the, uh, the neighbor girl. Uh, uh, I was just letting her to, uh, know to watch uh, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Oh, yeah, yeah. And we are back from that little break. Again, no TikTok of the day. Um, but I wanted to let y'all know. Give me a second. So last night, 
I put this on my face. Well, I put this on my face this morning, but um, while I was in the bathtub, I couldn't peel it off because I was in the bathtub and my water was a little warm and I started sweating. So I sweated that entire mask off. It was amazing. And I also washed my face with Noxzema and my skin is so smooth. It makes me feel like slick. Aaliyah, if you gave up on this product and just started using Noxzema, your skin would be amazing, okay? It's just, it's more so taking care of your skin every day. Now, I use my Noxzema and I also turned around and used the Midnight Oil that comes with this product. So, I think, like, maybe Noxzema and just a face oil um, every day. I'm definitely loving using face oils on my face. I feel like they give my skin a little something extra. But, um, we do have a new product coming through the mail, like I told you guys. Um, on top of that, the eye cream, I think I'm going to continue to use the eye cream. I still got quite a bit left of it. Um, and I think that it's good for me as someone who's getting old, you guys, 25. You know, I'm an old lady now. Um, to continue to use eye cream and continue to take care of my looks because they're not always going to be there. I mean, they might be there a little bit longer than certain counterparts. You know how they say, um, I'm sorry, but white people age like, um, you think Obama's gonna uh, age like milk too? I wasn't talking about mixed people. I was talking about white people. See, you over here being defensive, but yeah, you know he's aged like a little bit. Part. He's he's aged a little bit, but not too much, you know, because that black is saving him. What? I think the thing is, you don't think Obama has aged a little bit? No, I'm talking about. Him. Oh, I thought you were talking about me. Well, yeah, the yeah, presidential yeah. office will do that to you. Nah, it's the Caucasian. Mm -hmm. I mean, he does. He looks better now that he's not been in office. That's because Michelle been putting it on him. She wasn't putting it on him before. He had to get up too early. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> oh man, I wish I had a good um, Obama impression. I'm not in the mood. Chill out. But now they, they're relaxing together, you know, go through like eight years of stressful times just to come back out and shine like the diamond that we are. So yes, that is, that is my routine. Bada boom, bada bang. It was only like a seven minute routine. Oh, I mean, maybe I should talk about more stuff. I don't know. Maybe I should do something else. Like y'all. Do a flip. I can't flip for the life of me. Oh yeah, I forgot. This also comes with like a little cream that you put on your face. See? See, I've been half doing it lately that I haven't even did. See, I didn't run out of this product. I just like to point that out. I haven't completely ran out of this product yet, but it feels like it's time to move on. Breaking free, Orin, flying, get to the place that we know that we can be. You know, someone has been um, commenting under my video talking about, oh my gosh, like you're so annoying. And I was just like, I'm just being myself. And they said they know <laughs> every time. Every time I say that, it makes me laugh because like, they're like, oh my gosh, you're so annoying. Can't continue watching your video. And I was just like, why are you acting like that? And I'm just like, acting like what? I'm just being myself. And they were like, I could tell. And then it just takes me back to middle school and like people not liking me. And like, the thing is, it didn't bother me that people didn't like me in middle school. Like I did feel like outcasted and whatnot. And I guess that was that more hurt than anything. But there's a lot of people nowadays in my life my husband and people on the internet that like me for how I am, how I authentically show up. That was a little fan service. Anyone made it this far into the video. I didn't plan on doing that, but like sometimes I just be hopping, you know? Anyway, people like how I authentically show up. And so at this point, if people tell me they don't like me, it's like, okay, cool. The next person will, you know, or, or even if the next person doesn't like me, you know, there can be a bunch of people that don't like me. There's still going to be people that like me. They still exist, you know? <laughs> and when I was younger, without the aid of the internet and things like that, you know, there wasn't a lot of people that were telling me, hey, you pretty cool the way you are. But now as an adult, I tell myself, hey, you pretty cool the way you are. All I got to do 
honestly, honestly, here's the thing. People are so easy. People, mm, hey baby. <laughs> People are so easy. Anyway, for men, all I gotta do is put my boobs in the thumbnail and there you go, y'all click in the video. For women, it's a little bit harder, but like, I, I, I'm gonna figure it out one of these days. I gotta make some, I gotta make some um, female friends. Ow! You won't ever be hitting my butt, and now you want to act up in front of the camp. Come here! What? What? I'm trying to put her clothes away. You're supposed to hug me. Yeah. That's my husband. You sniffing me? I put I put two different perfumes on when I got out of the shower last I night. I can tell. Do I still smell good? Mm hmm I put deodorant underneath my boobs and underneath my belly flap. Well, it's not like really a flap, but it gets sweaty like right there where the belt would be, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So I put some deodorant there and underneath my boots. Like if you separate them, smell. Mm. Yeah, it's not sweaty like it. <laughs> I separated them a little bit too much. It's not sweaty and gross like it usually is. Anyway, that is it for our video. Much love and positive vibes. If y'all wanna see Stu, he's gonna do a whole video well, he's already did a whole video. This is coming out after his video. He did a whole video where he showed us his skincare routine, okay? So, go ahead and check that out. It'll be linked below or above. It'll be linked above. I don't link the belings below. That's too much work. Anyway, much love and positive vibes. See you next time. Bye!